insane so it might you might not notice a huge difference like right there look at this look at how crystal clear the zoom is now and i can get like get that right up in the camera isn't that insane <laughs> that's what revolutionized the camera and see. cheers boys look at that it even focused on my fingies isn't that weird you can see the all the particles in the water boys ladies gents the stream is a very simple idea today I am using Joey's camera <laughs> this is Joey's camera Joey has a fucking banger camera which we're definitely gonna use for like IRL streams and shit now cuz it's I mean it's so great um, but uh, I don't have the dummy battery for it so I figured let's just stream until the battery dies <laughs> they said it should be a couple hours it should be a few hours can I pick fuck no uh, but boys I got content planned no worries we're still getting spooky we're still gonna get scared today I uh, I found a game called black rose and it's free, of course, uh, but it's supposed to be pretty gosh darn good. Stream ends in four minutes. Yeah, all right. We're really testing the Sony A6100 today, boys. We're really testing it out. We're seeing. Dragon, don't tell me what to do, huh? <laughs> How does that sound? <laughs> so Gary's skinny game squad and ain't bad. Nice. All right, boys. I don't know how much time we got, so we should probably like jump into it pretty quick here. Cause I have uh, I have a couple things planned. Black Rose, I think. Black Rose, Bango Bango. In fact, if it's the game I'm thinking, it's actually quite good. It is quite good. That is good to hear. Uh oh, yeah, yeah, we're good. All right, boys. Without further ado, I present you Black Rose. Oh, hold on. Black Rose. I make more money than you at 14. Fuck you. Ban him. Ban him. Ban Dragon right now. Ban him. Do it. Ban him. Ban him. Do it. Flashing games, boys. F flashing lights, quick time events, jump scares. Let's go. Let's fucking go, boys. All right. Levels again. I'm going to... I'm gonna take a gravity. I mean, Dragon wants it. <laughs> if Dragon, it's up to you. Would you like to get banned? <laughs> I'll uh, I'll leave it up to Dragon and Carson. You guys sort that out. <laughs> Cause it would. It is a funny bit. Woo! Let's go. Reason he told me to. Yeah. Woo! Dragon, I think you're the first person we've ever banned. That's it. 
everybody can we get can we get some claps and chat for uh dragon what an honor that's awesome <laughs> that's fucking awesome <laughs> Oh, Dragon, make sure to appeal. He took one for the team. He really took one for the team. What a hero. Dragon, appreciate you coming here. <laughs> That's wild. Now we can test out the ban feature. That's exciting. All right, Dragon, we'll see you soon. Maybe later. Maybe another day. I'm not the mod at the moment, so we'll, uh, I'll, I'll leave that in the hands of the mods. Who will remain unnamed? Even though you can you can see anyways black rose boys Woo! timed mode story mode oh shit all right door code we all know how good i am at those all right i like i like the sensitivity Tab? Okay, okay, so tab is pause. I like that. Tab is pause. Remove the band. Woo! Dragon's back! Let's go! Oh, it's a click. Okay. Ooh, I gotta make sure that I don't get lost too much here. Locked? That was a joke, you're not banned for real. Exactly. What a good bit. What a good bit. Bam, 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 bam. Is someone else here? The doors work pretty badly. I don't even think I'll be able to get it open. Uh oh. Do, 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 do. That might be. Believe it or not, I'm going to turn the sensitivity down. Is that insane? There we go. Just because if I if I go too fast with these, I, I genuinely do have to turn one of these lights off. There we go. Hey, there we go. Actually, the low light looks way better on this camera, too. Oh, my God, that looks so much better. I can't see shit. This is a dark house. Who knew? All right, there's a there's also a score in the top left. Or, uh, okay, so family room dark game There we go yeah That helps a lot, but it's still scary There we go boys Does that help <gasps> my score is zero is that how many scares I've had? That helps a ton. But it's still like scary. I'll be dropping music. Oh, nice, dude. <laughs> Score zero. Wow. Who would have guessed? <laughs> I want to see music video. I want to see music video now. All right, so ladder, visitation room. Drop it right, drop it now, right this instant. That's what we want to see. I need a, I need a dope ass music video to get me through the scariness of this game. <laughs> no, fuck man. You gotta respect them for standing. Okay. Let's go back to this door. You're not my mom. <laughs> Trick him into it. Damn. When you tr you gotta try at least, you know. All right. All right. House is pretty cool. When I was upstairs, I heard someone laughing. Oh. Oh. Boss says not to go near the Myrtle's coffin. Why won't the gravedigger bury it anyways? It's not like boss is true. I mean, the dead can't talk, really. Can they? Question mark? I don't know. Can they? About to die in the game, by the way. What? What do you mean? Am I going to 
it's jammed. I might be able to force it open. I would need to ram it a couple times. Press an old space? You have a out three minutes from the start of the game until it starts to come for it. Oh, oh no. I have a bout. Oh shit. I was wondering, I was going to say, is this one of those games where it like just kind of, there's a baby monitor here. Strange. I can't ram doors anymore. Well, that, oh God. I don't know if I'm a time. What is the score? How do I, uh oh. Who was that? Come downstairs. Okay. Whatever you say, miss. Is this the downstairs it meant? Oh shit. Pain and suffering has warped their bodies. Badass, dude. Badass. Just kidding, you're good. Oh, okay. <laughs> that had me that had me panicking a little bit. Come downstairs. Well, I'm here. Hello? I did what you asked. Do I need to activate it from this way? You know, games and their activations, bro. Oh, maybe the family room. Nope. No lie, I just thought I saw something. Oh shit, really? Like a person? There's warp. Yeah, boys, keep me updated. Cause I thought I saw eyes, a figure. Ooh. I thought I saw eyes earlier, but that could have just been the reflection, you know, justifying things. Things are like just far enough in the distance to where it like kind of casts shadows. Maybe I need to click on the... Nope. Nope. Okay, turns out the thing I saw the door... So was the door handle and locks. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ooh, I'm so scared. Oh, that door opens now. That's the downstairs that wants me to go down. Boys, we got this. I've learned not to go sprinting into places because it scares me. Downstairs, brother. Hey, brother, come downstairs, brother. Oh, here we go. Her eyes do not look... Do not look in the eyes. Okay. Oh, it's a coffin. I need to get there. It's weird. I'm not sure I want to be here anymore. Something feels very wrong. Oh, the bait. Oh, okay, I get it. I get it. The sounds. Got it. Okay. Oh. Oh, wait. Fuck my. I think my eyes might be playing tricks on me. Oh, God. Ooh. This looks like a cutscene. It's 
not. It's not. We're good. All right, so there's where the coffin is. Oh, you know what? Maybe I go back upstairs. Since I found... Don't. Do I have to? Oh! What's going on? Is she coming up? earlier <laughs> oh! <laughs> the, the image itself isn't too scary but it's the, the shock value of it you know I'm on edge and you, you don't know what's gonna happen it's the unknown okay so now chapel's got to be open right sound is dude sound design really makes a difference oh here we go Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit, is she still there? Oh man. Oh shit! Oh fuck. You see her eyes turning red? I got a score. See the score? Is it for looking into her? Oh no. Oh no! Oh no, fuck. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh, she's gone, okay. <sighs> 125, boys, woo. Got a score. Uh, is there some good shit in that family room then? There's gotta be some good shit in here, right? This has got to be where our stash is. Okay, so that doesn't open. Wow. My whole... Oh, they sticked... They stitched him back together. Ghost can't even kill nobody very good. Exactly. All I got to do is not look at her. It's easy. She's very tall, though. Family room is going to open eventually. I'm just telling you. All right, so empty room. There's gonna be something in here one of those times. Door's locked. All right, let's try. Try this area again. Definitely be something on that poster board here. Locked. Rats. There's also gonna be something here eventually. All right. I feel like we're doing a pretty good job. Let's go down and check her casket. Doing this quick. Uh oh. I am getting lost in the labyrinth. I just literally went in a full circle. That's insane. Not only is that insane, but also cringe. Oh, here we go. Oh, key. Told ya. Told ya, boys. I know what I'm talking about. Oh, fuck you, idiot. Oh, God. Don't look at her. Don't, don't speak it. Don't say it. Don't speak it. Don't, oh, fucking shit. Oh, God. She's quick. She's a quick one. She's around every corner. Oh, fuck. 
fucking shit! Oh god! Oh god, she just fucking popped! You can't do that, bro! Oh my god! Dude, seeing the mouse freak out! <laughs> can't keep it still. Oh, Jesus! She's right there. Oh, fuck, dude. She's a quick one. Is she gone? Look at all my score that I'm getting. I think it, am I in this, am I, am I, am I off that perp right now? Did she inject me with something? Which door is this? Oh, you know what, which one it is? It's the one upstairs. Look down. Nope, I don't like that room. Fuck, where was it? Ah. Definitely this one, right? No way, really? Is it to the family room? I'm not afraid of you, idiot. I have a key now, though. Where does it go? Oh, family room. Oh, it's the chest. It's the chest. Another key! The only way to keep Myrtle in her coffin for good is to lock it. I thought I had locked it before, but someone else must have unlocked it. Either that or the lid was forced open. Key that is labeled Myrtle. So we gotta lock her coffin up? It's kind of cringe. And dumb. Hold on. can't there we go it's like I was born for it she in there I need to lock this thing oh silver key fell from inside the coffin it's labeled V room one Sound of us nice, right? Like vine boom. Something's coming. Oh, it's it's dead silent. Boys, get ready for something. Told you. Oh, that's not good. Gotta be this room, right? Damn it, really? Hmm. Oh, and I don't I don't see what my uh what my shits are. There was another there was another door that was locked somewhere. Was it downstairs? Might have been downstairs. game is cheap as hell and goofy as fuck but damn it if isn't charming dude you're telling me is it this one over here it's got a it's got a number pad to it oh okay v1 oh violation room Visitation room, not violation room. Oh my god. <laughs> Why did I say violation room? Oh man. That's uh. 
All right, so. Uh, what now? Eventually gonna have to go down there. <laughs> Is it in her coffin again? Oh, here we go. I'm not asking to speak. Not asking you to speak to me, but I made something for you today. At first, I thought about going out and picking you the prettiest flowers I could find, but decided not to. The flowers are beautiful, but eventually they all die. Instead, I made you an orgasmic rose. Uh, paper will never wither, just like my love for you. This rose is black because the love we share, once shared, is gone. Got him. <gasps> It was my it was last in the darkness and there's no ignoring that. However, even if this love is no longer mutual, there's still one side that will never die. This rose is our symbol. Nice. Cursive bleh, dude. Cursive sucks. Cursive is gross. Cursive is cringe. Boo. Or he's curses is dumb. Boo. Maybe I'm looking for a black rose. Hello. Is there a black rose anywhere? Oh. Idea. Family room? Nope. Empty room? Nope. Uh Chapel? I mean we were just there, but can hurt. What else do we gotta do? Or I gotta go upstairs to get to the chapel, yeah. Nothing like the pitter-patter of someone just running in circles, you know? Dude, that ghost was so scary that she turned all sound off. Richard... That that shoes. Damn it! Well, boys, looks like we're stuck in this house forever. Are you wearing high heels, dude? It sounds like I am. Andrew, how are you, my friend? Good to see you. I feel so so scary that I got that I got so scared and then I pooped in my pants and bonked my head. Shit, dude. I never wanted such violence to come to you, my friend. <laughs> I apologize that I subjected you. Oh, load? Big load? Big loads are always a good thing, boys. Never forget that. And you can get them with Gorilla Mind. Gorilla Mind helps you come a lot. Big load, gang. You've heard of Long Boy Gang from uh, Slim Jim, but you, you've you never heard of a uh, Big Load Gang b by Gorilla Mind. Ah, now my pants are full of poop and piss. Gorilla Mind, fill your pants with poop and piss. Use code Big Load Gang at checkout. All right. I'm focusing. I'm focusing, boys. I'm here. I'm focused.
Yeah! Ooh, I, oh, shit. No way. There's no shot that it actually died. Hold on. Hold on. Boys, I'm alive? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> no way. No, no, no. It's still on. It's still on. I think I just got to do one of these here. There we go. Hey, there we go. We're good. Yeah. All right, boys, we're back. Uh, maybe my next stream should be stream ends when OBS crashes. I'm glad that I caught it before it like turned like or stream turned itself off. I think it gives you like 30 seconds to get back. Oh, oh yeah. I was like, uh oh, all sound has has lot has been lost. Anyways, boys, we're back in action, and we're lost. Should I pick up the notes again? Do not look into her eyes. I won't stop harassing me. All right, where all have I not gone? I think I've hit every little like place in here, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have. Okay. So I've hit every area in here. <laughs> I was going to say there's no shot. This camera is supposed to last about oh, it's like 2 to 3 hours on a charge, so. This video is for, is for, is wolf. Is wolf. Song that the music video is for is wolf. Wolf. Is that, is it your song or are you doing like a music video for another person's song. I mean, the only other door is this one. Can I, can I smash it? I want to smash it. Chapel had the answers last time. So hell yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Whenever, uh, whenever you want to, uh, whenever you want to show us. Feel free to send that shit in the Discord, my guy. And we will, we will give it a quick watchy poo. You know what I'm saying? Camera, no way! Is it actually dead? No, it says there's some. Oh, it's overheating. That's what it is. Well, that's not very good. How do I how do how do I keep it from overheating? That's the question. Hmm. Range. Maybe it's because it's going straight off battery. And it's just constantly on. Oh, actually, you know what? I do have an idea. Two seconds, boys. Two seconds, boys. Oh, yeah, Dragon, feel free to send that in the Discord, my guy. Then we all can hear it. 
Uh, yeah, I have an idea. Give me a sec. Do that. In that. There we go. That's that. That might help. That might help. Go. Oh, that even kind of like zoomed it back a little bit too. Give me some more room. I did. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, brother. Let's get this. Oh yeah, geez, that really zoomed it out. Sick, dude. Whoa. There we go. We're back. It's oh, yeah. very cool, very sick. All right. I also was wondering because I changed essentially what I did is it told me to put it on the highest video quality setting for it. I was like, okay, so I did that, but it's it crops everything down and it also. 262. Buttons don't do anything. Do anything. But yeah, so I switched it back down. And now it gives me some more space. It gives me so, some more room to work with. And we can zoom it out. Sorry, boys, I'm fucking with the camera today. It's fun. Camera's ass. Your ass! We are running right off a of battery too, keep that in mind. I'm also not used to this camera. There we go. All right, oh, letter. Ever since my first day working here, I've felt a little strange. Now, after what happened that day, Things seem to be getting even stranger. I'd even go so far as to say creepy. I've been an embalmer for years now, and I'm very passionate about my job. I've always felt comfortable with what I do, so it's pretty unusual that I feel this way. Two of my colleagues have died. I had to embalm them both. <laughs> we all remember However, that day. <laughs> grief can't explain this feeling. <laughs> Up until just four days ago, I hadn't even known about the history of this funeral home. I already knew that it was ridiculously old, but what I didn't know was that it allegedly harbors some kind of powerful aura which traps and torments the spirits of people who have died in a state of grief or fear and have at some point been associated with the building in one way or another. These associations apparently include those occurring post-mortem, such as embalmings and funerals, Cool. Oh, no. Damn this camera. Yeah, I don't think it's strong enough to run off the battery. All right. Fuck it, boys. Streams changed. I, the idea has the, the idea has blundered. Another day, another time. That's all right, boys. The beauty of the stream. The beauty of the stream. Height, 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 height. Give me two seconds. Let me just switch cameras around. I did. Wow, that is hot as fuck and not in a good way. <laughs> well, boys, I'll put some tunes on. Fellas, I'll be right back. Rip Joey's camera. I have I have broken it. Joey's camera is forever destroyed. Two seconds. Woo! Party time, boys! 
Let's get it. Me, boys look at me I'm back hey hey oh. there we go that looks good there we go oh god I do love this camera though god damn it I sure do like this this cannon my guy I, there is a way to get the uh, to get the autofocus to be much better, so we'll do that eventually. But it also costs like a hundred dollars, so a little cringe. Let me fix the stream here. God damn it, boys! This is the blunder stream. The blunder stream. <laughs> Did you see that? The... <laughs> you didn't even see it. See it right there. Sent you a bit of the song. Fuck yeah, dude! Let's get it. Let's get it. Wolf. Some slapping bass, bro. Some penis music right there, brother. Yeah, brother that's sick dude i can't wait to hear it and i can't wait to see the music video dude dragon thanks for sharing brother dragon what a day what a day we've had with dragon we listened to some dragon's music and dragon also got banned today <laughs> god it's great Woo! there it is i love that nick not nice all right boys should we uh should we see if we can we can make it through a goddamn two second game for fuck's sake. All right. We, oh, okay. So we just, oh boys. I gotta get, I gotta get back in the, Ooh, I'm so scared. Oh God. Oh shit. The far, the other room. That key, you fucking nerd. I'm following where he's going. Oh, sweet fuck. 
I feel like it wants me to go down here. Yep. What are you hiding down here, you bitch? Nothing. Shit. No, okay, so that's just the soundtrack. Okay. So maybe it's not down here. God damn this labyrinth. Stairs? Damn it! Okay, so just retrace my steps. This way, this way, and then right. I gotta go by. Bye, Dragon. Thanks for stopping by. Bye, Dragon. Have a good night. Thank you for sharing your music. Have fun. Have a, good, have a beautiful time. Are we finally gonna go into the room? Yes, dude. I told you there was gonna be something on here. I was so right. You guys all said I was wrong, but I was right. Fucking right. Strains, please tell your son to stop playing under the fucking tables during the funeral services. It's disruptive and upsetting the grieving families. That he also stole one of the keys to the visitation room and it was all later attempting to op uh, open one of the drawers in the morgue. That behavior is unacceptable and it will not be tolerated. If you do not start controlling him, I will take it upon myself to personally teach him a lesson. No one told you we were wrong. Are you saying it was all in my mind? Am I playing mind games now? He also stole one of the visitation rooms. Okay. One of the drawers in the morgue. Okay. Oh, it's open. To make things, things even, even easier, weirder, this place has a serious lockdown system. Yesterday was the first time I've ever seen it used, and many of the workers, including myself, were ordered to wait in the family room until the situation was taken care of. No one I've spoken to about it knows why it was done, or at least they won't say. All I know is that these safety glass windows and electronic gates appear to be designed for keeping things in rather than out. Nice. I was the first responder that day. I was the first and only person to make it to Myrtle's side before she passed away. She managed to give Sullivan a parting I love you on that baby monitor, but that was the last communication they ever I had. I really like the uh, the looping. The last thing she ever the did looping was sound. Give me that piece of paper. It's nice. It was a short poem she had written for Sullivan earlier that day. She asked me to give it to him, and I promised her I would. Then she Poems, away. dude? I guess Sullivan had picked up by Myrtle's weak rasping in the baby monitor that something was Cringe. happening to her. Because soon after she had passed, he came running into the hall from the upstairs arrangement room. But he was too late. She was gone. That's when he broke down. I'd never seen him show so much emotion towards Myrtle before. Then, of course... The rest happened. I'll keep my promise, even now. It's all I can do for my dear friends. Sick. Oh. Game saved. Thanks, bro. Uh... There are a lot of strange things I've seen around this place. She was often depressed, so she was always There's going a sicker room down here. After all, I did learn from Michaels. Wherever it was, she went. Uh, to okay, I was gonna say we're not we're not gonna sit there and listen to him read that whole thing. <laughs> Shut up. They still haven't buried them. Sullivan has been lying in his coffin now for two days, and Myrtle for three. Because Conrad refused to touch Myrtle's as far as feeling touch Myrtle's what? Coffins, <laughs> I do get a strange vibe now in the visitation room. The atmosphere in there is 
Okay, so visitation room. Bargatation room. It turns out that Devin got into the morgue by stealing Sullivan's <laughs> key card from the office. I don't know why this is so funny to me, but <laughs> every paper is like uh, like a full pair couple paragraphs of just this dude reading and I could not give a fuck about what he's saying Always gotta check the chapel. You never know. I Could not give two shits about what that dude is saying because I have a feeling like it doesn't matter Am I wrong, but that's the story Should I go back and read it? What do I do do I go back and listen? Turns out that Devin got into the morgue by stealing Sullivan's, Sullivan's key, key card. card. In the office. <laughs> nah, Rains fuck it. Been in there and forgot to lock it when she left. Nobody knows exactly how the kid figured out the passcode, but considering what a flake his mother is, that's probably just something else. Actually, this is probably important. Compromised. They're burying Sullivan with a few of his belongings from the funeral home. I guess because he had worked here for so long and was so loyal to his job. Michael revealed that one of those belongings is Sullivan's key card. Of course, they would need to deactivate it from the system to avoid any breaches and the chance that it was stolen. But then again, Mrs. Rains would be the one who would do that. I discovered earlier today that Devin had stolen the system lock override key as well and hidden it somewhere in the building. Ah! This has got to be the most troublesome. So this is very important. I've ever encountered. Should we go back and read that other one? <laughs> I also, you know what? I gotta appreciate it because I don't have to read it. They are reading it for me, you know? They still haven't buried them. Sullivan has been lying in his coffin now for two days and Myrtle for three. Hmm. Because Conrad refused to touch Myrtle's coffin after her funeral. It had coffin, to be that's what they're so Sullivan could have his. Reading sucks, dick. Conrad if you're reading this, you're fucking do dumb. This guy sucks. This guy's all dumb. He's doing is preparing a future grave without actually touching the coffins. I'm starting Not to even touching the coffins. Encounter with Myrtle and Sullivan's coffins, or he heard some absurd rumor about their corpses. What's sad is that Myrtle and Sullivan don't have relatives who care enough about their burials to actually do something about this. Sure. Michael was embarrassed to have to tell all the relatives and friends that the actual burials couldn't be held yet. Even so, none of them objected. Maybe they just didn't see a point in doing so, considering the person they would be doing it for is already gone. I don't know. Oh. As far as feeling nervous around coffins, I do get a strange vibe now in the visitation room. The atmosphere in there is starting Where's to feel Where's notable? I'm not different. quite sure if I believe in ghosts, but the locations have uncomfortable, and maybe it's not... Okay, of... that's just normal stuff here. I got cinnamon toast crunch! Ah! Dude, cinnamon toast crunch sounds fucking delicious. Dude, there was one day where I crushed like five bowls of cinnamon toast crunch, and it was one of the best days of my life. Genuinely. All right, is it in the violation room now? But I need a key for it. She is still, she is still stunned in her, in her coffin. We did a stone cold stunner on her. Oh, fuck. Your reader, it looks like it requires a passcode. Is it 69, 69, maybe 69? Cereal's insane. This can't be good for me. Yeah, cereal's not the best thing for you, but you could be eating like 4 million McDonald's and Taco Bell burgers and burritos instead of a bowl of cereal. You ever think of that? Alright. 
this little rat bastard has hidden the key somewhere. Is that what I'm gathering? Thought of it. Thanks. Thought of it like that. Thanks, Caleb. Time for bowl number four. Let's go. Cereal. Cereal. I like cereal. I like cereal. Oh, yeah. Let's go back in this room. There are a lot of strange things I've seen around this place. For instance, the fireplace that isn't even a real fireplace. It's some kind of ladder shaft, but there's a tough metal grate fastened over it that appears to be controlled electronically, most likely by the lockdown system. I'm assuming the shaft leads down to the basement, but it must have been sealed off. <laughs> Shut it's not up. Accessible Shut up. I'm on the phone. There. Another thing I've hey, started hey, wondering hey, hey. about is a metal Shut handle shh, shh, that's been hey. sitting on Michael's desk on for I'm about on, a month I'm on the now. Phone. I'm on I asked about it once out of curiosity, but he avoided giving me a direct answer. He told me it broke off of something. I had already assumed this, seeing as it's covered in dirt and rusted around the edges where it had clearly been attached. I've been to on the end of that for before. A very long time. Perhaps the biggest mystery I've here the is the phone. place Myrtle always went for privacy. <laughs> oh. She was often depressed, so she was always going into the downstairs hall on her way to wherever it was she went to be alone. However, she seemed to vanish. The only place she could have gone from that hallway is down into the basement, but I went down there one day to ask her something and I couldn't find her. I'm wondering if there's a secret room somewhere down there. After all, I did learn from Michael that this building is from the 1600s, long before it was ever a funeral home. Buildings as old as this one sometimes have quite a few secret areas. Ah! There's a t there's a secret room down there somewhere. There's nothing in here and I I must be missing something. You know Homer a fucking snooze factory, bro. Damn, dude, you tell me, huh? You know, I feel like games like this would be a lot better if I didn't suck so bad at like figuring my way out of like situations, you know? I didn't have to use my gosh darn brain. And I also get distracted very, very easily. All right, so I'm guessing I gotta go find a secret room. There we go. Chief, oh, grief stricken man. Chief stricken man <laughs> killed by train after blinding himself. What? 57 year old Sullivan James, one of the two funeral directors. The trip to follow the track, so I'll call train, call your co workers at the funeral home. James had slipped in the state of grief stricken hysteria just minutes early after experiencing an emotional breakdown over the death of a childhood friend and co-worker Myrtle Van Worth, who had been suffering from a severe brain tumor which doctors had deemed inoperable. Ms. Varnworth passed away nine days after the end of the predicted death date. James devastated, apparently gouged out his own eyes using a scalpel from the funeral home's preparation room and managed to scramble out a nearby window. He managed to scramble that window like an egg. That's not before he finished Poppy Playtime. Oh, it was good. Panicked by drunk <laughs> pancake. <laughs> That's right. Pancake, pancake by drunk dump truck driver. Don't have to say how they died. Just shut up. I was traveling in and they never buried either of them. Both are still here. Cringe. Something written on the back. They say if you take his rose, he wakes up. That's the only way his coffin will open. I heard that he also tears you into three pieces if he catches you. Something's under the table. Oh! <laughs> they won't find it ever. Those eyes kind of scared the fuck out of me. 
This game kind of nails the scares, even though I can like see them coming. It's weird. All those attending the funeral service for Sullivan James, please gather in the visitation room. What the fuck? That's crazy. Ah, that was an old one. They don't say babies forever. That's crazy. Like, it won't even let me go up there, I don't think. Oh. Uh, wait. Where do I gotta go? I gotta go to visitation room. I have to go through here. Ah! Whimskers. Let's go and see what this happens. Oh. Oh. I understand. Listen, pal. I understand. Huh? What is this? What is this like a paper? What is it like a paper bag? What is this an amogus? What is this a milk carton? What is this, uh, a really shitty drawing? Let's go see what this happens. <laughs> Not what I said. Ghosts are cringe. Dark. Dare you, dare you, double, double, dare you. There's a black origami rose laying, yes. Oh, fuck. Uh oh. Oh, fuck. Does it want me to come and look at him? Sullivan James was blind as a bat. Sullivan James fell down um, flat. 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 Sullivan James is withered and blue. Sullivan James will get you. Is coming for you. Ghost that tries to scare me is cringe as fuck, idiot ghost. You're gonna die. See, like, this game is obviously low budget and made by like one guy, but this shit kind of rips. It really does. This game, where am I? Train brakes squealing are fucking awesome. He was killed by a train. Yeah, dude, this game. 
game is cool. I'm gonna close this for my neighbor's sake. <laughs> All right, that's where I'm at. Chapel time. That section is so cool. A little, the little poem before he pops off is rad and generally creepy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is coming for. I was gonna stay standing there, but I'm glad I didn't because he would have. He was gonna jump out and fucking destroy me. There's something written on the back. Don't get scared by the kid. <laughs> That's good. Sullivan James is coming for you. Sullivan James is about to take a poo. All those attending the funeral service for Sullivan James, please gather in the visitation. Now, here's the question. Do I Oh, I got to go down to her. That's what it is. 100% that's what it is. And the key was in his coffin to get out of the room. I ran up to it and just clicked it and I could barely hear like a tick. Sullivan James was blind as a bat. Sullivan James, James fell, fell down, down flat. flat. Sullivan, Sullivan James, James is withered and blue. Sullivan James is coming for you. That is so fucking scary, actually. Thank you for 100 bits. I could not hear the fucking thing <laughs> from all of that sound. Thank you, Carson. James P. Sullivan. Oh, shit, dude. This is him as a ghost. See if I can... Can you hear that? Holy shit, this game must be cranked in your head. It is, yeah. Yeah. It's a, uh, I, I try to turn it up so then when you guys play that stuff, it is over the game. You know what? I'm going to, I got to start doing this. I'm going to start putting games at 50% volume. And then just turning it up a little bit for you guys. So then I can actually like hear. It made that section very comedic. Awesome, awesome. It always does. It always does. That'll be a nice. That'll be a nice little uh, little thing in the video. Oh, <laughs> 
Amazing. Amazing. There we go, Carson. I can't wait to see it. Yeah, because I haven't quite nailed down the, uh, like, the back and forth volume thing kind of fucks my head up. Because it's like, I can play it loud for you guys. Oh, wait. Maybe I just need to, I might just need to turn the sound stuff up. Yeah, I'll just turn the volume up. That's what it is. And I'll turn it down for you guys. Boom. Figure it out. Sometimes you just got to sit on it. Oh, whoops, I forgot the child. I forgot to go visit the child. So then, I don't have to crank everything up super loud, and it's just always really loud for me and for you guys equally. Because there are times when, uh, when I'm mainly on PC, it's tough to like balance the audio in my head. Having that having you know something that i can mix in my head individually would be really nice is that what the go xlr does i'm able to mix stuff in my head specifically too instead of like going to each individual thing and turning pieces up and down there's something under the table egglos are sick there we go that's better for me and it looks like it's a it's about the exact same for you guys. Pog. All those attending the funeral service for Sullivan James, please gather in the I was wondering why Sullivan James sounded so familiar too. Oh wait, fuck. How, where do I go? What do I do? That's the thing, because I it's not... Because he said, oh, the rose was placed on his casket. So it's not down there. It's not. Is it in the? Would I go to the? It's not down. It's not the in the waiting area. It's not down here. We already tried that. They still haven't buried them. Sullivan has been lying in his coffin now for two days, and Myrtle for three, because Conrad refused to touch Myrtle's coffin after her funeral. It had to be put aside so Sullivan could have his. Conrad still simply doesn't want to have anything to do with the burial of either of them. As far as feeling nervous around coffins, I do get a strange vibe now in the visitation room. The atmosphere in there is starting to feel different. Hmm. There are a lot of strange things I've seen around this place. For instance, the fireplace that isn't even a real fireplace. It's some kind of ladder shaft, but there's a tough metal grate fastened over it that appears to be controlled electronically, most likely by the lockdown system. I'm assuming the shaft leads down to the basement, but it must have been sealed off because it's not accessible from anywhere down there. Another thing I've started wondering about is a metal handle that's been sitting on Michael's desk for about a month now. I asked about it once out of curiosity, but he avoided giving me a direct answer. She was often depressed, so she was hmm. always going into the downstairs hall on her way to wherever After all, I did was learn from Michael wrong. that this building is built. However, she seemed to vanish. The only place she could have gone from that hallway is down into the basement, but 
I went down there one day to ask her something. And Going into the her. downstairs hall. Michael's desk. Is this Michael's desk? Reader. How do I enter it? Can I not? Until I pick something up that goes here. Has wrapped their bodies. Hmm. Napalm, what's going on, dude? Welcome. I haven't gone into the chapel yet. Yeah, I saw something pop up. I saw something pop up. It turns out that Devin got into the morgue by stealing Sullivan's key card from the in office. The office. Mrs. Rains had been in there and forgot to lock it. Dude, how are you? Dude, congrats on a thousand Nobody followers exactly today, by the way, my guy. It's fucking dope. Code, but considering yeah, the there we go. Mother is, Literally on the exact same page. Something else she congrats, dude. That's a big moment. They're burying Sullivan with a few of his belongings from the funeral home. I guess because he had worked here for so long and was so loyal to his job. Michael revealed that one of those belongings is Sullivan's key card. Of course, they would need to deactivate it from the system to avoid any breaches in the chance that it was stolen. But then again, Mrs. Rains would be the one who would do that. Key I card. discovered earlier today that Devin had stolen the system lock override key as well and hidden it somewhere in the building. Maybe that key card opens the door? How the fuck do I put a link in my bio? Oh yeah, you go to... Uh... Or wait, do I have a link in my bio? Holy fuck. All right, boys. Uh, it's actually a whole Damn. My Code Miko video is at like 8K and I posted it four hours ago. That's pretty cool. Our pizza toppings. <laughs> Dude, I was watching Code Miko stream. You know what, we'll just throw it up. Wait for it to restart. It's actually a whole lot faster. <laughs> so, um, what's wrong with this? <laughs> Dude, Code Miko streams are insane. Uh, yeah, dude, rip. Dude, Robbie. Dude, like I said, though, he'll live on. And he was he was even like, yep, he's like, you know, he's like, I won't I won't always be here, but. But Haggard will. That video. Yeah, oh, yeah. Literally, I just posted it right before I left. Before I went home. From that Giants, dude. Tell me about it. All right. So, Napalm, we've done this a couple times. We we just don't know where to go. Oh yeah. It's very cool though. The scene is very cool. Sullivan. You just have to outlast him. Eventually, he'll disappear. Oh, okay. Cool. Sullivan James was blind as a bat. I can go live now, too. Yeah, on Sullivan your phone. Sullivan James fell down oh, yeah. flat. Did I get my fucking stream key yet? Nope, not yet. God damn it. Give me my stream key, TikTok. Sullivan James Turn around and avoid is him. withered and blue. Cool. Sullivan I'll just do that in James here. Sullivan James is coming for you.
for you. things even weirder, this place has a serious lockdown system. Yesterday was the first time I've ever seen it used, and many of the workers, including myself, were ordered to wait in the family room until the situation was taken care of. No one I've spoken to about it knows why it was done, or at least they won't say. All I know is that these safety glass windows and electronic gates appear to be designed for keeping things in. I was the first responder that day. I was the first and only person to make it to Myrtle's. Yeah. So yeah, we just wear them down. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm gonna plan a good route. So if I run up the stairs here, which I will, and I, yeah, okay, I'll just circle this way. So I'll run up the stairs, go straight through the door, and then run back down. Okay. We got it. The plan. TikTok's gonna blow up. Hell yeah, dude. TikTok. TikTok. Oh, yeah. Whoa, continue. Dude, kids are scary, bro. I'm fucking scared. All right, I got it. I have a plan. If that door gets locked, I'm gonna be pissed. Got early morning tomorrow, so I don't know how long I'm gonna say. Dude, no worries. Appreciate you being here, brother. I actually have an early day tomorrow as well, so. And that'd be, uh, might finish the game, might watch some scary videos. 
who's to say? I, I, I'm to say, I, I'm the one running the street, but uh, you know. So we're at eight. Ooh, I'll, I start at nine. We're close, but you are an hour ahead. So technically the same. Is that how time works? Go through more TikTok DMs. I actually have a couple spooky videos James that I picked out just bat. in case. Because the original James idea fell down flat. Was to uh, go until James the camera died. Is withered and, and then it overheated. So Sullivan James hour is behind you. Gotcha. You. Sullivan, you bitch. Thank you, Carson. Something just fell where Sullivan was. What? Look at that's a back button. That's a that's a back on a controller button. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Count the lines between. Count the lines between the lines. Oh, okay, what's going on, dude? Count the lines between the lines. One, two, six, so two, six, four, two, six, four, two. That the number of lines a X has. So it's so I did do that. Or am I just dumb? So Two, oh, no, 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 sorry. Two, six, two, six, four, two. Is that what I entered? Might as well. Two, six. No, two, six, four, four. That's what it is. Yeah, two, six, four, four. Fuck. It's just a long line that connects itself, maybe. So two, nine, two, nine, four, two, nine, four, seven, two, nine, four, seven. Dude, you called it, Carson. Good shit. Dude, good shit. I thought the circles were a decoy, but you nailed it. Uh-oh. 
Oh, let's fucking go! Work time, dumbass. Cold. I mean, if you want to call it that. Clicking, I'm clicking. Yes, yeah, so it wasn't that. Everyone here is dead. Paper. They've all been killed. Ghosts in this house are not like ghosts in other houses. If they're looking for something specific, their corpses actually get up. Someone threw the lockdown switch and I can't get out. I finally found the override key, but I'm not sure exactly where the switch is. Although, I might have an idea. I remember overhearing a conversation Michael was having a few months ago about something which was located underground. I'm confused as to whether or not this underground location is the main basement where Myrtle's coffin is. I went down there a while ago and looked around, but it appears to be mostly a storage space. Maybe I missed it. The basement is extremely dark, even with a flashlight. Maybe I need to go search again more thoroughly. She is down there. I need to find the switch. My very life depends on it, as do the lives of many future wanderers if this doesn't stop. One of the most unsettling things about this funeral home is that if after I just went, a while, went out. No you start shit. Hanging by a oh, damn it, dude. On the verge of collapsing. You love it. Then it only by spectrum the spectrum force that fills the building it's such a strange feeling maybe i'm not the uh, same skeptic i was before working uh, here but where is that that damn, damn switch? switch in the deepest part of the house it's in the deepest part of the house boys X marks the spot. Okay, what is that? Oh, it's a chair. Those are chairs. Those are the chairs. Okay. In the... In the, um... Chaffel. Yeah. So... S second one in... Got it. No.
<laughs> Thank you for the pets, Carson. <laughs> Damn, someone's jamming. Anyone who saw or spoke to it with Devin the day he went missing come to my office immediately as me. Behavior helps Devin would always noticeably excited and start behaving suspiciously when he had plans of doing something he was supposed to. There is a key. Sussy. Sussy key. Over I key. Now all that's left is find the switch in the deepest part of the house. Is that where Merle's coffin is? Place even deeper underground. I'm guessing it's in the fucking fireplace. James going to bankrupt me on my weekly bits at this rate. <laughs> Shit, brother. Your eyes ignites me like a spark. It is them for which I'll search forever in the dark. Shut up. Going the wrong way. I am. Is this like a witch situation? Where is she? I'm trying to help. Sorry, lady. I don't know where you're at. You'll ever just think you're going to have have a huge chunky shit. She just sit on the toilet only to pee straight liquid out of your butt. I do do that. Hmm. What's in here? Back in there, I'd rather not anyway. It's definitely coming from like right here. Let's go check on old Mert, huh? I still think I'm right. It's in the fireplace. There it is again. I think I get more of a score when I look at him. And that was the morgue. I found the key. Now where to pee? Where is pee time? This room's kind of just like a nothing burger, huh? Someone in my neighborhood is having a fire and it smells cozy in my basement. Oh, ooh, ooh. I love the smell of just fire. It's like a barbecue. Something else in here that I missed.
Hello? Ma'am, do you need help? Dude, the other night, I don't know what was going on, but I swear every police car, fire truck, and ambulance must have been rushing somewhere in my neighborhood. Ooh. Scary. Sirens were loud as fuck. It sounded like 50 of them. Wow. It was scary. Ultra scary. In the deepest part of the basement. I think that's definitely coming in the family room. Yeah, it's got to be coming from there. And there's nothing in this room. The deepest part in the, of the house, as in like, where do you find, where do you go to escape your feelings the most? All right. We're doing it, boys. Does house have a bar? I don't think it does. It's really helpful. You can never escape your feelings. Shit, that's why I'm just never escaping this fucking house. So I'd go. True. So figured out how to do the link. Nice, 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 nice. Link in bio, pussies. That's what you can say at the end of all your videos. At the end of all your talks. Hey, idiots. Go click on my stuff, dummy. God, guys, does this, does this happen to you as much as it does to me? Where you just get kind of fucking stuck in games like this? Because you miss, like, the one piece that you need to activate something. Clips I post, you can put them as the caption. Let's go. All the McFucking time. Okay, cool. So I am not the only one. What is the one thing that I need to do? It's not here. It's not down in the basement. It's not over fucking here. It's not in here, apparently, because I can't fucking do shit. I have a key and a security override. I'm guessing there's a note somewhere that I've just missed. Drop something in. Uh, I think this was it that he dropped. If I'm not mistaken. Because I think he was like, that's where he died. So I was running up this way. I'll retrace my Sullivan tracks. Yeah, that was definitely that note. And this, someone is crying. Dinner time, baby. Let's go. I just opened the door. Boys, I just got the mobile notification that I'm alive. Let's go. My mobile dashboard is ready for me, boys. It only took a long time. <laughs> I 
have noticed that with this game too, you just kind of happen upon things. So there's kind of like, it's just kind of a, kind of a search, search, search game. But here's the thing. The pieces are a little teeny tiny and they're in very obscure places. So that makes it a little bit frustrating. Also, I am bad at games. So take that into put that in your pipe and smoke it, you know? Remember what to do and it's frustrating me, right? Like I'm not the only one who's like, what the fuck do I do? I've done a, 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 literally everything. A, 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 literally everything. If I can, if it'll, if, if, if it will s fucking move the plot forward, I would love to go back in there and have James P. Sullivan absolutely ravage my body. Please. <laughs> Bro, same. <laughs> Literally my Twitch pile. I have failed you. Damn it. You hate to see that. But on a good note, boys, the new Blink-182 song fucking rips. So with the bad also comes some really goods. Beats time. Okay, it's so nice to hear Tom's voice back in blink again. My god. I have Missed it. I do love angels and airwaves But damn The trio big song was super underwhelming really uh, I liked it. it It's it's ex it's like what I expected of it, you know? It's like it's like Punk, it's like pop punky, but it's a bit more like, I don't, not modern. I don't really know how to say it. Had a little bit more of a swing to it. I saw it coming from Angels and Airwaves for sure. But I liked it. I, uh, I enjoyed it. Although, very bias. Very bias. Damn it, I thought I'm, I'm looking for so much shit that I thought the tile was it. Oh my God, what do I do? The family room is the only thing I can think of. The game is very dark. Yes, it is. On stream? Oh yeah, geez, on stream it. Come on. Oh, it actually looks pretty. It might be your monitor, Carson. Or whatever device you're look, we were watching it on. But on my other one, it looks pretty, pretty bright in this in the dead center, at least. It is just a very dark game as well. This is with the brightness cranked all the way up to. Isn't that insane? Oh, boys, X marks the fucking spot. Give me get put an X in my ass and 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 go digging around. They're crying and yeah, it's just my phone. I can mostly see what we're doing. But OK, cool. Yeah, the crying. I'll turn it up a little bit. No, I'll leave it where it is. The crying is 100% coming from the family room. And this game, well, let me get there. <sighs> and I feel like that's where I have to go. Within your eyes ignites me like a spark. It is them.
Well... The hint that it gave me was in the deepest part of the house. And then he was like, where Myrtle's casket is or coffin or somewhere deeper. And I'm like, all right, well, the only deepest part I've been, haven't been, is the fucking ladder. But then check this out. I went in a full circle. Isn't that insane? Do something, Myrtle. Fucking do something, please. Holy fuck, boys. Is this going to turn into an Apex stream? That's... I just realized that's kind of canon now. <laughs> As like... Fucking unending stream themed the apex stream now that's really funny all right fuck this game is so good but this game is also so bad like when you get to what you're supposed to do this game is 10 out of 10 but when you're in the when you're when you're in the in betweens, it's a fucking one out of ten. I feel I'm so fucking bored and lost. And I get it. That's the point of the game. It's to confuse you. But when the shit you're looking for is unfindable, that's when shit starts to get a little cringe. And then we're just sitting here with like a couple of jabronis. Just running in goddamn circles for 400 hours. What's going on? What's going on? Let's go, boys. talking about oh oh we're going new song ah oh, seamless transition oh Here we go, boys. Here we go. Hey, 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 hey. What's deeper than a chapel? I don't know, boys. You fucking tell me, please.
as we need his information on his whereabouts, favor as soon as possible. Did Devin break the game? Boys, it's groove time. Well, now I know this place like the back of my fucking hand, huh? I can't go into the morgue. Under the stairs? You're fucking shitting me. Interact with the floor tile? Other stairs. Yeah, I ran under here like 400 times and I was clicking all over the place. Where was I supposed to click? Oh, I'm so mad right now. I am. S this is such bullshit. That's, that's what I'm saying. That is so dumb and such bad design. There you go. Thank you, Carson. I appreciate you. This is it. Now I know where Myrtle always went for privacy. Now I know where the handle on Michael's desk came from. Devin must have been trapped. The, uh... The gimmick was uh, that stream dies when the camera dies because I have Joey's camera right here and I don't have the battery pack for it. Um, so I was going to do it when it died because it's supposed to be like two and a half, three hours, four hours maybe. Uh, but then it overheated. So uh, yeah, so that, that was the bit and it went really well. That's the case and you've made it this far. I'm sorry to say that I probably never made it out. However, I can tell you that I know for a fact the switch is down here. Once I flip it, I will leave the control key behind. Yeah, it if overheated and it, like kept turning off. Somehow. It still had like 50% battery left though. Nonetheless, there's one last thing I can give you, and that's a promise. These tunnels are not a dead end. At some point, there's a ladder which will take you back up to the ground floor. I don't know how far down it is, but I know that it's there. I always did feel a very faint draft coming from that fireplace. The sounds always seem to echo down into it. After disabling the system lock, there should be a definite. Can we just path. eat the camera? That's a that's a good oh, idea, actually. Stifling. I think Joey will be down with it. Also. The fucking, the fucking bull. Okay, so here's, here's bullshit. I call bullshit on this. Okay, right? So I knew that I was supposed to, like, there was something in that hallway. We have to click on the fucking tile down there? Bro, eat shit. Because I clicked on the top of the stairs over there. I went into the full circle and clicked everywhere. 
I just had to be aimed down a couple more inches. Nah. Bullshit. That's what I'm saying. Ghosts after all. Anyways. I'm a little spicy tonight, boys. I'm a little heated. We had our first band tonight, boys. That's that should tell you where I'm at spice-wise. Spice level wise. He gets so mad when he's scared. No, I don't! It's almost an hour. How is that editing? Actually, pretty good. After clicking, it only took me a day. Full day of cutting it all down. And then uh then the I slept and then the ne I, next day I went through and just put music on it and everything. Uh, but yeah, it wasn't too bad. Thank I thank God that I was clicking the clip button because it got everything that I was hoping for and more. Where is the band? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it might not show up because stream broke twice on top of everything else tonight. Um, uh, oh, yeah. Dragon Dragon Gaming was like, I make more money than you and I'm 14. And I was like, ban him. Ban his ass. Carson was like, do you really want me to? And Dragon's like, do it. Do it. And I was like, I mean, if he says he wants to, <laughs> I said, I'll leave it up to you guys. And then he banned him and then unbanned him. It was fun. It was a fun little experiment. Carson, how did it feel banning someone, by the way? Did you feel powerful? I felt bad. <laughs> Classic. I've banned someone before. Really? Wait, who did you ban? What's the bit here? Gain in this room may jam while opening. Do not be alarmed as this common occurrence will resolve. 10 seconds. Let me guess. James P. Sullivan is coming down. Oh. Do I need to find something? It looks, yeah, those look like pieces. Maybe not. I mean, I banned bots. Ah, a while ago. Any, oh, that's right. That's right. I remember that guy. I can't remember exactly why. No, because he came through and was throwing the N-word around, right? He just like right at the end of stream. That was wild. Oh, glitching out a little bit there. Yeah, that was wild. Right at the end of stream too. The fuses are all missing. Stay calm. telling you boys I'm, I'm getting real familiar with the whole like finding things before I've actually activated things fuck please no
good. That's pretty good. Thoughts on subspecies. It was fucking awesome. What's subspecies? Is that a game? Is that a movie? Is that a YouTube video? Television series, maybe? This, this is... All right. Empire for, oh, that's right. Is that the one that we looked up? Justice told me to check out for possible video. Hell yeah. Yeah, because we watched the trailer on stream, right? You're gonna die, baby. Die, baby. One, two, a little bit of a glitch there. So one, two, three. Four. Five. There are a lot more about, <laughs> a lot more tits in that movie than I thought there would be awesome. So one, two, no, I'm not gonna cut that one, one. Oh, it's back there. Nice ones too. the last one baby die baby oh fuck where was it oh there was i got it i got it Down the best. I died. Did I? This is it. Shit. I love how small of a space they put you in with him. It's really nice. It's really great. It's really like not bad at all. You have just one little thing to run around. That's it's pretty cool. I I think it's pretty pretty pog and definitely not cringe and lame. I do get kind of mad when I get, I get scared. I've been getting mad at games a lot more and it feels kind of good. Invest in them for the stream, the claymation. Oh. I'm down for clay, little claymation boys. Hurry up! Oh! 
was really cool. I'll say that. That was really cool. But also, fuck this. <laughs> the, the, uh, yeah, I thought it was gonna I thought he was gonna stop there boys. I'm mauled in a little bit. I apologize <laughs> Mad Caleb mad Caleb <laughs> Well lots of sauce in my belly tonight Boys, what can I say? I had some spicy pickles and they're coming through Cool off nerd <laughs> it's just hella salty Yeah, I get a little salty. It's funny because I'm bad at games, but then I get salty about not Being able to win games. So it's just a really perfect combo it's Just the game do we No, it's not Apex the apex stream taught me one thing these games these streams are my freedom I don't get to continue living until I'm done that's what I've learned. I do like this song. You rat bastard, pick it up. Poppy last night was just like this. Skill issue. More like a, uh, fuck you issue. Got him. Got him. It's like during chase scenes are one of my favorites. It's great. It's great. This skill is just screwing up bad. Yeah, it is. I'm, I'm bad. Look at my score. It's back down. Damn it. <laughs> the month James P. Sullivan. Yeah, this guy's name is Sullivan James, by the way. Justice. I gotta do at least. Yeah, I guess you're right. Carson, always the voice of reason. Boys, I could speed run this game after this.
Why is it actually good though? I think that's my problem. Is it's actually good and I want to beat it. Let's chat. What, what, what do we got going on in chat, huh? He knows how to fail better. I admit better than 90% of the, it really is. It really is. Watch the gamer time die. Watch the gamer time die. Oh, you called it. Oofy's legit angry. Called it. Caleb, you tried yelling in the pillows of therapy. Oh, I should do that because I got I live in a duplex situation. I almost yelled. I if I was in if I was in the old house, I would have yelled. I would have yelled like loud. I would have screamed at the top of my fucking lungs. That's where I'm at right now, boys. I almost threw my headphones on the ground. I almost took these head these cherished headphones that I've had for years now and fucking just, uh, fucking hooked them on the fucking goddamn ground, baby. Oh god. All right, boys, I knew I got these duvet covers for the pillows that I have for a reason. Mmm. Mmm. It's a cooling pillow. It cools you as you sleep. It's called a breeze pillow. You put it on your head at night and you go, and you go, mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to keep the pillow here just in case I need it. Mmm. Mmm. He played Apex for 15 hours and lost 51 games with no issue. When he dies in Black Rose, he loses his mind. I don't know why. I think it's because I knew that one was going to take a long time, and this one, I'm dying because... Like, that one, I understand. Like, that one, I suck with Apex. I understand. I'm, I'm learning. This feels cheap. When, I, when it's a cheap... When it's cheap deaths... That's when I take offense. I take personal offense. This is when you die because you're supposed to. Not a fan. Maybe that's why I never really got into like Dark Souls very much. But no, see, that's a skill. That's like one that like I'm going in and you're supposed to. I know that. So with this one, it's like, it feels like I'm dying when I shouldn't be. Like, when I win this game, I'm not going to feel as good as, like, a Dark Souls boss, you know? I only like it when people die when they're not supposed to die. So relatable. <laughs> dying of Dark Souls, don't get hit for it. Damn. You know what? I'm glad you guys are here because you're really, you're really, you're really talking sense. And it's, it's bringing me back down to earth. The blues are the die, baby. Oh, baby, blue. You bitch, pick that shit up. You wanna die. Stuck here too, so I heard the song shitload times because I already played the videos all the time. 
It's James P. Sullivan. I just closed the door on myself. Save my ears at least. Yeah, there you go. I am. I do feel much better. Thank you. <laughs> I'm better than big guy. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Shut up, headphones. I don't. I don't think I need to read that. Hey, join the Discord. Join the socials. I'm suffering. Help! Help me. You're gonna die. I guess she did call it. That's the thing is she called it the whole time. Beat the mods. That's gonna be tough when I passed out from screaming my lungs out. I, I can't really talk to the bank rep or the post office to send where I need to send the crackers. I mean, uh, saltines. Carson, thank you for the one bit cheer. Thank you for the cheer, my friend. I appreciate it. Carson, thank you for the one bit cheer, my friend. I appreciate it. Carson, thank you for the one bit cheer. I appreciate it. <laughs> Bye, baby blue. Wanna cry, baby. Go up the stairs.
It does not let me go up the stairs. That's why I died. Because I felt like it was holding me back. And then he killed me. I thought that was part of the, like, animation. The front door is not open, correct? The front door is open. Because I turned off the security lockdown. I'm a dumbass, dude. Can't go up the stairs because I'm supposed to leave the fucking house. Oh yeah, just go out the front door, dumbass. Just fucking go out the front. <laughs> I gotta get the fuck out of this house. I better go up this fucking stairs. Okay, I'm a lot less mad now that I'm understand the front door bog dude now that i understand what i'm supposed to do i feel at peace see when i know what i'm supposed to do i get happy again but it's when i'm confused which is a lot of the time i get angry ah you won't like me when I'm confused. Cause I'm a bit of a little pussy baby about it. But what the dog doing? You see these dogs in your front yard? Just know that I'm going hard. same level as the game does it kind of drown does it work can you hear me right now can you understand what i'm saying nice cool. i've always worried about that I'm sure the game's just really loud, though. There's two endings? I'll tell you what you can do with those two endings. You can suck a fat one, boys! Suck it! Second ending one. Nah. Nah. <laughs> Shut up, sorry, Carson. <laughs> Carson, I'm just kidding. I love you. I love you, boy. I love you, my boy. 1340, 1380. Bad score. Carson, no. It's so, it's so sad. We're known as the completionists on this channel, though. 
Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Oh, is this where the lady... Because this lady is from... How is there another ending? Oh, wait. Hello. Uh, we're playing uh, Black Rose one last time because I just recently... <laughs> found out that there's a I just recently found out that there's actually a secret end into the game. End into the game. And I want to get it. I don't know what happens. I just know how to get it. <laughs> I hope it's worth it because I have to do this whole scene again where I run free. You have to go to the bad ending. I'm not uh, what the ending meant, so probably bad fade, ending. Yeah. I'll just cut to the minute that I get near the hey, final sick. ending. Sick, sick, sick. I'm not fading this your time. Oh, the other endings if you run that was my other thought was running downstairs. There we go. Hello. Hello, Sullivan James. Uh, what happened? Oh, they fell in love again. Oh, yeah. Did I die? Because if I died, then their love is not worth my death, <laughs> in my opinion. <laughs> oh. What's going on here? I love how they like only found each other because I led them to each other whenever they love on the same I house. I love this guy's for accent. Years. And they couldn't just like Can't just stick. walk about. A oh, bit walk about. Coffin. Sounds like they are ghosts after all. Okay, info commercial seller. Oh, fuck spider. I'm alive. Holy shit! Oh, the that house crumbled. crumbled. Whoa, we said at the same time. A black rose. Black rose. We said that at the same time. And that's the. And ending. that's the end. That was the, that secret, was the ending. secret ending. Not worth it. Like... Caleb got bad ending. Yeah, I guess I did get the bad ending. Where, where is this photo from then? Because that's if you type in the if you type in Black Rose Game, Black Rose Game. Oh, it's a different game. This game is called The Black Rose. The one that I'm looking at. Oh, whoopsies. <laughs> they got the good ending in, a in Apex eventually. You turn into a 13 year old in a cold lobby. Stay with me. Uh, all right, why did this just do that? Hold up. Not again. Come find me. She leaves us the red rose as well. Yeah. Even though this place is so this is what I thought it was. Oh, it's like one of those. One of those other games. 13 minutes. So it's probably it'll take me like four hours to beat. Gotcha. 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 Go through a loop with weird demon. Oh, OK, so this is like a loop game. Huh. We might have to play that one. We played, we played Black Rose. Now we need to play the Black Rose. And then, boys, eventually we'll get to this. We'll get to the Mortuary's Assistant. I'm just a little scared to play that game. And it also costs monies. But I do get paid here soon. So we might, that might be on the docket. That's going to be a, uh, that's going to be a, that's going to be a weekend stream. Because I want to beat it all in one sitting. And I don't know how long Jack says it looks like Jack took about an hour 43. 
probably take me like 40 hours then. It's your boy's time to do some adulting. Oh, shit. Does that mean going to bed? Boys, is it bedtime? Is it bedtime, boys? I got my little pillow here. I got my little pillow here. Does that mean it's bedtime? I think that means it's bedtime, boys. <laughs> yeah, this is my jerk pillow for sure. Boys, for sure. No doubt. Boys. And trying to get more sure assists because that could be sick. There's multiple endings to that game, too. Boys. Thank you so much for sticking with me through my rage and through my pain today. I appreciate I appreciate the pillow tip as well. That really helped. No laundry dishes, buying new clothes, banking cards, and stuff. It's classic. Boys, if you're watching live, I appreciate you. If you're watching the video, I appreciate you equally. Join the Discord. Follow the socials. Boys, I'll see y'all tomorrow. God damn, this song rips, huh? Bye, boys. I appreciate you. Have a great night. Have cozy, restful sleeps. I appreciate you to death. And, boys, I'll talk with you later. Bye bye! I did not miss the drop. I uh, definitely hit it. I didn't mean to get the drop. It's a new song. I haven't gotten used to it yet. Where's the drop on this one? I'll get it this time. Boys, if you're watching live, I appreciate you. If you're watching the video, I appreciate you equally. Uh, and join the socials, join the Discord. Uh, and boys, as always, I will see you all. Tom bye bye See I got it that time. Yeah, no one's really online to raid, so and I just I'm very tired, I'm gonna go to sleep. Bye everybody, bye! I, I accidentally got I accidentally got the drop on that one though. So Bye guys. Bye. Bye guys, I love you all. Bye.